Let's go. It's your boy Lucky Sam, and I'm here with Edmund. <laughs> Wait, what's the difference between Dosto and Namaska? Dosto means friend. Oh, hello, friend. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Namaska, everybody. <laughs> yeah, Namaska is like hello, hi, hello. Okay. And Namaste, like this official greeting. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. So Namaska, so, like friendly greeting, like hi, and what's namaste up, yo? Is, Wow, it's so funny. I'm teaching you. <laughs> I'm teaching you. <laughs> I'm teaching you Hindi. <laughs> okay, guys, in today's video, we will be reacting to 10 villages in India that are extremely bizarre. How do you pronounce that word? Is it bizarre? Bizarre. Bizarre. Wow. <laughs> okay guys, so without wasting much time talking too much and yeah. I don't know. Let's that's why we are watching the video. Maybe extremely like did you uh uncomfy. Okay. I don't know. Let's see, let's see. So guys without talking too much, <laughs> let's just go straight into it in three, two, one. Wait, Wait say three, two, one in India. Hmm? Say three two one in Hindi. I should say three two one in Hindi. <laughs> ah, ding do ek. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Did you? Yo, know? oh, really bizarre yet unique. No way. Is that child holding a cobra? I guess. Let me start the. Let me let me start the video. Well, it's no surprise that a country has a lot to offer in terms oh. of diversity. But did you know? Whoa. Really bizarre yet unique villages in India. <laughs> okay, I now understand what this video is about now. I, okay, I never expected this. Snakes. At about 200 kilometers oh, from Pune in wow. Sulapur district is located a village named Shetfal. No. Here, cobra snakes have a permanent abode in each and every house and they are worshipped daily in every home in this village. Snakes here have no restriction in their movement and none of the 2600 plus villagers ever harm them. In fact, they never harm them. Welcomed in every home as a member of the family. No way, Neither you're the kidding me. Nor the residents live in fear of each other. <laughs> no way, no way, hey, hey, no way, no, you, 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 no, you, you, no, 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 no. I think one of my greatest no fears way. is that I'll be no, in the, no, 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 the, like no, no, I'll no, be no. in the bathroom in the WC and then a cobra just <laughs> outside. <laughs> just, oh, oh, I cannot leave that. I know this place is not for me. I cannot hey, leave. Yo, that. Hey yo, hey yo. I, I, I just. Yo, worshiping I I I love to explore. Like it's my dream to explore India, but I think this is not going to be part of the list. <laughs> this is where you draw no, the no, line. No 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 no. Maybe I might be flying in a chopper and then looking at. I mean, I get the snakes. Some snakes are nice, but I'm not. I'm not no going way. anywhere no, near no, 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 no. Please, no. I'm black. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I'm no. black for a reason. <laughs> hey, yo! Wow. No, this is a different place, right? Yeah, village with no doors. In the holy village of Shani Shingnapur, in Mahara, I think this is the number nine. Homes, but no doors at all. Whoa. No doors? Meeting over 40,000 devotees every single day. This village has houses with no doors. Or no doors. doors? They believe that Lord Shani would protect them from any calamity and they sleep off peacefully with open homes each night. Yo, this is so weird. No, but it's dope. It's like everybody trusts their name. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Number eight. This is we are now. Hibari Bazaar was struck with poverty and drought some 30 years ago. But in the 1990s, the fate of this village changed, where it transformed into a wealthy village with nearly 60 millionaires. All of wealthy. Should we relocate? Uh, no, I think I, we have to relocate. <laughs> we should bro. relocate. Hey, yo, we need to relocate. My facts are fine. Wait, I'm Let's coming. just go. I, w I want to check the place again. Number eight. Mahashtra. It's in Maha Maharashtra. Oh, Maharashtra. Yeah. <laughs> but what is this? Hiwari. Hiwari Bazaar. You'd be pronouncing it like this, but in here, so come and then don't pronounce it in the center. <laughs> Hiwari Bazaar. <laughs> so just say it and you'd be like, huh? Where, where did all the words come from? <laughs> so I think the pronunciation from us would be wrong. Though, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Okay, I think we need to go there. Okay, the village of millionaires. Wow. Maybe if we join them. Yeah, we need to go. Tucked away in the Ahmednagar district of Maharashtra, Hiwari Bazaar was struck with poverty in 30 years ago. Okay. But in the 1990s, the fate of this village oh. changed, where it transformed into a wealthy village with nearly 60 millionaires. 60? Yeah. 
All are farmers. Just rupees eight thirty per month back in nineteen ninety five to over. <laughs> so it means those days, if you make eight hundred and thirty rupees per month, yo, you are fucking dusted. <laughs> you are freaking dusted. <laughs> wow. Eight thirty rupees per month back in nineteen ninety five. Not even per day, per month. <laughs> 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 no, it's not like I'm laughing. No, like it's funny. Wow. Rupees thirty thousand today. Okay, 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 okay. In, in it, it makes sense now. And then now so today is thirty thousand. Yo, thirty thousand a month is a month or a day. No, it was um eight hundred and thirty rupees per month. And now it's thirty. And then it, yeah, it's not it's, bad. It's not it's bad. Not, it's, it's, not bad. Not it's good. Bad. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's good. I now understand. Bare Bazaar has 60 millionaires, and this village is a quintessential example of a developing nation. Wow! Yo, actually, I've been wondering what makes someone a millionaire. Is it like if you have one million states in your, like, sorry, one million in your accounts, then you're a millionaire? No, so far as you, you possess, because like I was thinking have... about it. If that's the case, you know how our currency there's like mm. one million cities. Then technically, no, 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 you no, have one, one million cities. It's, it's, it's the old currency. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying then at that time, then I yeah, used to they, think they that everybody was yeah, millionaire because yeah, 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 yeah. then, then I always thought millionaire was just like yeah, yeah. easy to But now it's not, it's 100 CDs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Punsari village is a hospital. village of 6,000 in the Savarkantha district of Gujarat. Every home has toilets, there are two primary schools, a primary health care, street lights, and a drainage oh. system. And that's not all. The entire village is Wi-Fi enabled, has CCTV Whoa. cameras installed, nah. <laughs> checkpoints, and a public address system which covers the entire wow. population with the help of 140 loudspeakers that are installed all over the village. Any Yo. place with Wi-Fi, I'm moving. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Any place with Wi-Fi, just oh, then call me, place, I'm coming. This I place is love Wi-Fi. This Gujarat, the African in the village. village. Jambur, near Gir, in the heart of Gujarat. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know about this, this one. Like they are Africans, but they stay there. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you every know every it. African knows because the yeah, first yeah. thing when you come to India, the first thing they tell you is yeah, yeah. have Africans staying here, yeah, yeah. thinking African you can relate. Origin, but Gujarati in speech and manner, you could easily mistake it for Soweto or Mombasa. These people are believed to have been brought from Africa by the Nawab of Junagar. Since Islam was the prevalent religion, they followed their new faith and adapted to the local environment. Kodini. A remote village in Kerala's Malapuram district is a mystery to research. Hey, oh, my internet. This is a nice it makes place. Me this village has the largest number of twins in the country. Hey, According wow! Yeah, yeah, I was watching this on Instagram, I think, two days ago. Now, like, everybody gets confused because even the teachers are twins, students are twins. <laughs> <laughs> but I think Nigeria has the largest twin city in the whole world. Yeah, Nigeria. Really? Yeah, there's a tribe, I think, the Yoruba, so the Igbos. There's a tribe in Nigeria that has the largest twins, and I think India is the second. Wow. There are at least 400 <clears throat> pairs of twins in the village that have a population of 2,000 families. Would you like wow. to have a twin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's going to be crazy. <laughs> Even I, I wish I wish I was a twin. Really? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But my parents always said like having twins is like a lot of work, like yeah, yeah, yeah. draining. But I wish I was a twin. Like it's going to be awesome, I swear. Think of twins as hard, no, really? like living with my twin here in India. Oh, jeez. You fight. <laughs> even with another human being that's hard enough. No, no, no. We are not going to fight. Okay, even though twins, we can have... Twins fight more than anybody. No, even that's though... One thing. Even though we are going to like have, you know, misunderstandings. But, yo, it's going to be fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going to be so fun. <laughs> Doing... Wait, would you prefer an identical twin or a fraternal No, twin? identical, like 100%. <laughs> yo, it's going to be fun. <laughs> I think it would be that fun like, but like no it's going to be fun in such a way that like when you go out you're like oh the comparison yo bro what are no comparison i, I just i told you that we should go here it's like are you sure it's, it's me, me. <laughs> no nah, no nah, it's not me i'll go out i'll be like yeah okay this is the person no it's not me, it's me. The... <laughs> as long as because as long as we can switch class and yeah, 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 for yeah, each yeah. Other, i'm good no, i'm good <laughs> In Kodini, the number is as high as 45 in 1,000 births. Mm. Mm. 
in the village of Bachelor. The village is called as the village of bachelors because for over 50 years no one has gotten married in this village. Oh. <laughs> village of bachelors. <laughs> There's also like the city in <laughs> Colombia or something. Oh, some everybody's country. single. Yeah, the women there are looking for wives. So why don't they just like? <laughs> okay, the the women. Are single. Yeah, the women there. Everybody's looking for a man to marry. In and I think. Why there's no there's not even one single man there. Yeah, like no man is there to like. I don't know if there are single men Yo. there, but I know that every woman there are single and looking for somebody to marry. And yes, men. So why don't they just like? <laughs> Makes wow! It. Yeah, but yeah. Indians, in, I don't think Indians themselves like interracial marriages yeah, like yeah, yeah, a lot, yeah, yeah. so probably that's why. Shocking! It is the lack of infrastructure and amenities that no one sends their daughter into this village. Oh! oh. Wow! Cleanest village. Wow! Long, located in Meghalaya, is called. Wait. So why did they call this video bazaar? Bizarre, or whatever the word is. I don't know. Okay, the beginning was okay. Then, okay, okay, okay. The, the beginning of the video, and it has enough reasons for that. It was awarded the title of cleanest village in Asia by Discover India in 2003. Oh, a full hundred percent literacy rate to a highly progressive scenario for women. This village has struck all the right chords, but does it have Wi Fi? <laughs> The, the village. Out of them all, the people of Rongdoi village organize frog weddings as they think it is responsible for rainfall. It is for them to please the god of rain. <laughs> Hundreds of village folk, young and old, boys and girls, gather. This is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is one of the most beautiful cultures I've ever seen in India. Wow, like to please the god of rain. Wait, so is the god of rain like a frog? Have you forgotten that? No, like. Anytime there is a rain, like that fateful night, you know, the frogs, frogs. you know. Okay, okay, so frogs are associated with rain. With rain, no, actually water. I mean, but they are amphibians. So... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 at Rongdoi village till late night to witness the unconventional marriage. There is a mythological belief among Hindus that if wild frogs caught by people are married off with Vedic rites and traditional marriage rituals, just like human beings, it can help bring rainfall in the coming days. <laughs> the, the person, person is the person, person help. The person making the commentary like is laughing. Uh, it's laughing, <laughs> yeah. But Michael, does it really help? I think it helps. That's why they're doing it. Really? Yeah. You Frog. know, when you believe in something, it works for you. Have you uh, forgotten? I've heard that, but hey. Yeah, if you believe I, I, I it's believe that I've had like ten million dollars in my account since No, you I was didn't a child. believe it. I you believe it, but no, no, it's no, not you, sure. were, you were you were imagining. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So there's a difference between yeah, belief yeah, and imagination. Yeah, there's a, two different the, the, the Korai village in Maharashtra is where everyone speaks in Portuguese. Yo. Right, oh. But it's true. You'll be greeted in Portuguese, even the names are Portuguese and people eat Portuguese food. You wow. can call it mini Brazil in India. Though it was built by Portuguese, it has been around for hundreds of years to keep the heritage alive. Wow, oh, this is amazing. Yeah, this so is nice. Call it bizarre or call it unreal. You can't deny the fact that our country has so much to offer in terms of uniqueness and culture. India's diversity is just like amazing. Oh, is that a red snake? Red snake? snake? Yeah, it's a, I don't know. What, what color is that? <laughs> Let me go back. Uh, what's with Indians and the obsession with snakes? You know, actually, snakes like has like when it comes to like uh, signs, you know. Yeah. Signs. And yeah. Symbols and snake is really? a powerful something. Yeah, yeah. Just don't know why they're so obsessed with snakes. Yo. It's a, a pool of cobras. Yeah. Yeesh. Oh, wow. So, amazing. in this video, which place do you wish to visit? The place with Wi Fi. That's where you visit? Yeah. I'm visiting that place. Oh, plus the cleanest city. As long as it has Wi Fi, I'm okay. moving there. Me, where I would visit is uh, where the millionaires. <laughs> but 30k people. Yeah, 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 yeah. So far as I go there, they'll be like, yeah, 
Yo, as long as you're good, yeah. money. <laughs> so far as I have the the money, I can buy Wi-Fi. Don't worry, I'll, I can go, make... I'll travel to the front village and pray for rain for you. So that <laughs> the, farm... <laughs> the farm works very well. Wow, this is Yo, insane. I like the I like the diversity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's like it's, amazing. It's, it's, the diversity in India is so crazy. You learn so many things, guys. And many Brazil speaking Portuguese. Wow. It's kind of difficult to imagine an Indian that doesn't speak like Hindi, Telugu. Yeah, or, like, and then just, speaking Sporti- Portuguese or whatever. I, I want to. Wow. I want to hear from those people and hear how they relate with the other Indians outside their. Um, uh, you know, space. it's different because um, I have a friend from Kerala. Okay. Yeah, he feels like a foreigner in, in the northern part. Not northern part because he 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 speaks only uh, what's the language? And Telugu. Telugu. No, no Malayalam. Ma- Malayalam. 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 What? Malayalam. Malayalam. Are you sure? <laughs> I think so. I, I had a friend from there. <laughs> I, I like Malayalam when you're speaking it. Yes. It's just really funny. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's dope. I yeah. just like the language. Only that language he speaks. Really? So when he relates with the others, they speak English. It's so weird. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, guys, if you enjoyed the video, I really enjoyed it, but not really. Comment and let's see which. Yeah, place yeah you let me know like in the comment know. section, like. Or yeah. which place you'd like us to explore? I would like to explore India, but not the snake place. <laughs> <laughs> Even if they gave you an invite, no, 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 personally no, no, no. come and see. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, no, 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 no. I wouldn't. My ancestors fought the war. They, they didn't fight the war for me to go and see snakes. Yeah. There are lots of snakes in Africa already. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Other than that, we are out. Peace.